Hola amigos, my name is Lauren. My family of four travels full-time in an RV. We're in our fifth year of full-time travel. We've gone all over the United States and all up and down Baja, Mexico. We're currently in Baja. We bought some property here and this is going to be our winter home. I'm going to start making or try to start making um, some pretty consistent YouTube videos. I just feel like the way we're living here is a little bit unconventional. We're living in our fifth wheel on our property, no hookups, no amenities whatsoever. Um, so I'm just going to start making some videos about what exactly it's like to live off grid, some of the projects we're working on here on our property and just what everything things like uh, living in Baja, Mexico. After Mexico, we are heading into Greece. We're going to spend three months on an island, uh, the island of Syros. So I think we have some pretty cool things coming up that you guys might be interested in. So I'm going to try my hand out at YouTube. If you hate my videos, let me know. If you like them, let me know. Everyone has to start somewhere. So here we go. Also, I would love for you to drop any questions you have in the comments below, anything about full-time RVing, traveling full-time, um, living off-grid. I love uh, answering people's questions and just if anyone has the desire to live very unconventionally like we do, I'm always willing to help. I actually just recently wrote a book about how to get on the road full-time as a full-time RVer. It's an ebook that is has a ton of beautiful photos from our travels and all the information you need to take the steps to hit the road full-time and become a full-time RVer if that's something you're interested in. But like I said, we document daily life on our Instagram and Facebook channels. So follow us there if you want more details on the way we live. But I'm always open to answer questions or having conversations about our lifestyle. My project for today is I'm going to clear out a spot for our friend's RV to pull up onto our property and stay for a few weeks. I'm going to clear it myself. When we first got here, we went to Home Depot in Cabo and got a few tools. And these tools have proven to be very helpful in just doing little things around the property. So let's see what it looks like to make an RV spot for a friend. These hedge trimmers were the best purchase that we made when we got down here. We got them at Home Depot. I think they were about $10 or something, but for most of the clearing out that we need to do here, these things are perfect. Some of the plants, the most common plants that we have here come up really easily. Just take a little bit of um, manpower with these things and I'll show you how it is. So as you can see here, it's starting to take shape. I still need to remove this area right here and that bush right there, but it's starting to come along. So plot twist. As it turns out, our friends don't need to use our spot after all. I knew that this might happen. They said, wait, before you start clearing it, we'll let you know if we are gonna need to use it. But I am not a very patient person. I was excited to work out in the yard. I really love doing it. But you know what? Maybe we'll use that as a little rental spot for boondockers. Um, it's just a small spot. So maybe a van lifer will take it and use it at some point. Who knows? We have a lot of fun um, and exciting plans for our property. And I can't wait to tell you more about it in future videos. Thank you so much for watching.